The pandemic has forced people to focus on their health, including celebrities. But when it comes to weight loss, some stars are more transparent than others. Today, we're revealing some of this year's biggest celebrity weight losses with the help of our friend to the show, host of Daily Mail TV, Thomas Roberts. What's up, man? Yeah, it's been a wild year in celebrity transformations. And so I'm sure you noticed, and so many others have noticed, a transformation in one of our favorite singers, Adele. It yes. was back in May. She posted a photo from her 32nd birthday. No mention of weight loss, okay, in, in the posting. But it was really clear that she had lost weight. She looked fabulous. Now, more recently, she appeared on Saturday Night Live, and she was the host. And she joked about her weight loss, saying, I know I look really, really different since you last saw me because of all the COVID restrictions and the travel bans. I had to travel light, and I could only bring half of me. <laughs> and this is the half I chose. <laughs> this is something that surprised a lot of people because we had known this celebrity, this wonderful singer in a certain way, and now we know her differently. Yeah, and 150 pounds lighter, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, that is the reported amount because there is no actual confirmation uh, about how much exactly she lost. But yeah, Dr. Ian, about 150 pounds, people say. Or has she said actually how she lost it? So now, she hasn't exactly revealed, uh, but she did talk about something uh, called the, the CERT food diet. Now, this is something that was started in the UK back in 2016, and it lets you eat certain foods, included red wine, strawberries, and they work together almost in unison as power proteins uh, to help accelerate your body's natural way of getting rid of fat and also providing you with more energy. And there was a boost, a Google boost, after her performance as the host on SNL. A lot of people wondering about that exact diet and if it would work for them. There's actually, you know, not too much research on how effective the diet is, but, you know, people, of course, are always looking for, for a way to get something, you know, a little easier than others. And if there is some type of magical combination between red wine, strawberries, and chocolate. Count me in. <laughs> that's right. That's right. All right. Let's get to the next celebrity. All right. Well, someone who has been looking for maybe that magic for a long time, someone we've known in the public eye, Kelly Osborne. Her story is well documented uh, with weight loss and weight gain. And she's been talking about her weight since 2009 when she admitted that her emotional eating had led to an uncontrollable weight gain for her. Uh, she said her battle, her previous battle with prescription drugs uh, also went hand in hand with her weight struggles. Now, it was in 2012, Ian, that she followed a plant-based diet. Now, she shed 50 pounds then and was able to maintain that look and that weight for years. She also said at that time she was using a hula hoop, uh, core <laughs> exercise, uh, mm -hmm. great way to sweat. Yeah, but right. also during that time, Kelly had a debilitating seizure. Now, that was a big setback for her. And it also opened her eyes, she said, to never taking good health for granted, which is absolutely true. But she said that being skinny wasn't important to her, but feeling good was. Yeah. I, I mean, listen, amen to that, because we so much talk about how people uh, think that the weight is going to make them happy or the weight loss is going to make them happy. And it's not always the case. Uh, we fast forward now to today. She's looking great. She's also revealing that she's lost some 85 pounds in total. All right. Who was our last celebrity? A singer rapper Buster Rhymes. So back in October, he showed off his weight loss transformation on Instagram with an inspirational caption to go along with it. Woo! He was working with heavyweights, apparently, to strengthen the chest, also to work on that core, the gut. Uh, he also revealed uh, the trainer that he started eating meals. There were leaner meats, chicken for Buster, salmon, bison as well. Mm. And he had to limit the booze mm. to shed these pounds. Yeah, you know, Thomas, people forget that even though alcohol is liquid and the calories are liquid, a calorie is a calorie is a calorie. So uh, that's awesome that he did that. Well, Thomas, of course, always glad to have you. Thanks for joining us, and uh, we'll check back in with you soon. Great to see you, Ian. Thank you. All right, man. And, of course, check your local listings to watch Daily Mail TV and get all your latest celebrity news.